Well, hello YouTube friends. I've been in a lot of talk recently about uh, hardtack ship's biscuits or whatever they're called. Uh, people have been making a few of them, a few people, and uh, I had made some about five years ago. And uh, I was curious to see how they held up. They're supposed to last like forever, so. I gave them a try. I made a little bit of uh, soup and I soaked them in them and they, they become palatable. I mean, I guess if you were, if you needed to survive, they would be just fine probably. Not really very, I mean, it's flour and, flour and salt. I mean, you know, how good are they going to be? But, but it would be filling, you know, and they did soften up after a good long soaking and I've dipped them in coffee and let them sit in coffee for a while and and they were palatable but uh, today we're going to try something new with them. Uh, let me change this camera around a little bit and uh, I'll give you an idea of what we're going to try. I, I don't know if I'll, I'll be able to fulfill my obligation to them but We'll, uh, we'll give her a shot and see what happens. See if we can find a new use for them. Be right back. Okay, can you guess what my idea is yet? It has nothing to do with soaking them in any liquid. But we're going to see how they hold up if I'm able to hit one to a slingshot. They're not so tough after all. They are pretty evasive though. Well, I guess that one's going to be the only one we get today. Well, I chipped one. Well, I guess the uh, only option is to bake bigger crackers because I certainly can't seem to hit those ones. But uh, the one I did hit shattered and the one I, I nicked chipped off so they're not as tough as they make themselves out to be. So One more test for the ship's biscuits.
I didn't think we could uh, do this whole video without me talking, did you? Or eating, for that matter. I would say this is a taste test, but anybody that uh, is on YouTube and hasn't eaten ramen noodles is uh, missing something. Yep, those are ramen noodles. Okay, that's all folks, just a few things that, uh, little projects I did playing around out here today. I wanted to try out that new stove I bought down in Kentucky uh, at the meetup. Uh, works really well. Uh, got it from uh, Bombproof Bushcraft. Uh, lights fast and burns hot so uh, I think it's a it's a nice little add-on thing here just throw a handful of sticks on it and leave it out here beside the thing at camp and uh, I think it'll work out well I still have my uh, my stoves from Fabric Creations to take with me and I'll just leave that one here at the camp in case I don't feel like uh, making a big fire or something so y'all take care be kind to one another and I'll catch you on the next one